Magix version 24 is here and this is good news for Android 12 users because right now you can root your Android 12 and safety net will pass. Uh, that means your device will be certified on Google Play Store, you can download your banking apps, Netflix, whatever that requires, you know, you know, device certified will work just fine. The bad news is for older devices, Magix uh, 24 version 24 and above is 64 bit only. So older Android devices like Pre marshmallow lollipop uh, devices that are running that two bit only will not work. The fight between the developer of Magisk, Top John Woo, and Google is still going on. Google keep tweaking the security settings of the CTS profile to detect root easily and you know to make the device not certified. But then the developer Top John Woo keep you know walking around that, and now there's a latest development in version 24.1, which is Zygist. So what is Zygis. We're going to talk about that in the video and much more, but let me give you a clue. Uh, Zygis is a combination of two words, Zygot and Magisk. So combine Zygot and Magisk, you get Zygis. So if you're ready, we're already on version 24.1. Come with me, let's go check it out. <laughs> Hey, welcome back again to Smart Deport, and I'm so excited to have you back here. If you're new to Magisk Android routing and all that, um, you can check the link in the description um, because I did a special playlist for you that will explain a lot of things for you. I've done videos about that in the past. Um, if you're watching for the first time and you're new, please, please click on that subscribe button right now and turn on the notification bell icon. Uh, just like share it it helps us to keep making beautiful videos like this so what's new with magisk version 24 uh, we're already in 24.1 as i will show you right now uh, but what's new the the before we talk about what's new let me share a few things that are that have been removed from version 23 in this version 24. Number one is Magisk Hide. It's not that you can no longer change Magisk app, but it means that you can no longer use the function Hide Magisk from all you know detection, all forms of detection. And this is because Google keep tweaking and tweaking and tweaking CTS profile, you know, how to make sure that the device is certified on Google Play Store and all that. Next in the list of removal is safety net checking app from the Magisk app. Now, Google tweaked some things in CTS profile API and developer of Magisk, Top John Woo, decided to focus on more important thing and leave that part outside the app. So, talking about more important thing, this is Zygist. I'm going to put the link in the description so you read up everything about that. Yeah, Zygot is the first Android process and then Magisk is now, you know, injected into the demon uh, for uh, Zygot in when Android is loading so you can read up all that uh, but you remember that uh, when I did the video you can check the card now about Magisk Canary that's where Zygist was launched so if you compare the two right now Zygist in the stable one is still in beta you can see that but in, in uh, Canary is already stable it has been tested over and over Canary is actually the experimental uh, part of it uh, both of them will work uh, I'll show you later in the video how to you know make safety net pass after flashing uh, version 24.1 because by default safety net will fail after flashing it so let's go in now it's in APK format right now so you already know that from the last video you download the APK and let's go in flash it and you know make safety net to pass you reboot into recovery like you flash any other thing any other zip that you flash reboot into recovery now you'll be able to see the apk the 24.1 apk is there and you can flash it so many people will say how do i convert it to zip and all that no you don't need to do that anymore so once you flash it you reboot your phone you you update the app and all that so once it's ready installed so this is magisk now working let's go and check safety nets so after installing it, safety net failed. Let's check it again. Wow, it failed again. So, like I did in the other video about Magic Scannery, you have to just go and use Zygist. So, to enable Zygist right now, you got to go into your setting and then you're going to scroll down to uh, Zygist. It's in beta here, but you can turn it on because it works just fine, like in Canary. And then turn on uh, uh, Enforce Deny Lists and then go into uh, the lists tap on the top uh, three menu at the top and then say show system apps so now you're going to go to google play services like i did in the other video and then 
select uh, uh, Condot Android uh, GSM and then look for unstable and then select it's Condot Android unstable. These are the two things you need to do. And after you've done that, you just reboot your phone. So uh, installing Magix 24 uh, 1 won't just make you pass safety nets. You have to go in and then do this uh, Zygis and then enforce denial list and then reboot. So now you've done that and then when you go and check and run safety net again, safety net will pass. You can use your banking app, every other app that you use for. Okay, so that's it. That's a wrap up of this one. If you really like this video, I want you to click on the subscribe button, like the video and then share. It really, really helps us out. Um, so that's about that. So until I see you in the next video, peace. Subscribe. I'll see you.